as a team, you know, it, it hurts as far as whenever a player goes down. But, um, you know, coaches always talk about, you know, the next person who's up, you know, they got to be prepared at any moment. And I think we've done a really good job of doing that. Uh, uh, Khalil did great. Um, I mean, just, just being a freshman, you know, going to your first game, and it happened to be at the situation that he went in. Um, it, I, I think he, his composure was great, just the way that he handled it. Um, you know, he, he showed a lot as far as for the future of when he plays, just running. I mean, that's the biggest thing. I mean, uh, you ask Coach Dues, you know, just run and, you know, just let the, you know, let it happen. You know, if, um, you know, happens to get a pass interference, you get a pass interference, but, you know, always focus on as far as going to catch the ball at any moment. I mean, that's a big thing that he's talked with us since day one. You know, just run and, you know, things will happen naturally. And I mean, that, that's obviously the last couple of weeks got, you know, a couple of pass interferences. Uh, he's he's handled it great. Um, as far as just he's he's helped out as far as the quarterbacks, um, you know that's a big thing. Um, but also just the way that he's attacked as far as the his rehab and everything that he's done as far as just everything over the last couple of weeks that he's been out. Um, he's done everything that he can do physically and mentally as far as to to help out the team. I mean it's helped out a lot. Yeah, I think I think the first half was great, and um, I think. One trend that we need to get corrected immediately is probably coming out in halftime and giving up a touchdown. I think um, with that, I think the past few weeks we've done that, I think the last three games, and uh, definitely uh, changed the momentum of the game. We came in uh, with the momentum, I thought, going into uh, third quarter and um, giving up that touchdown kind of loses that momentum. So uh, when we come out in halftime, uh, defense is on the field, we got to get off the field and we can't let them score. Um, I think definitely part of our game plan was to uh, disrupt the quarterback, and um, we got in his face early, and I think that kind of messed up the timing between him and his receivers, and uh, especially on third down, and our run defense on first and second down improved a lot this week, and uh, we took our front seven took advantage of uh, their front seven, and it got us in better position on third down, and we were able to bring pressure and uh, dial it up, and uh, with us doing that, I think that helped us get more three and outs. Um. Actually, I got to step up. Um, one of our most um, good player part size um, is down, so I have to step up and be able to make plays and um, believe in the play calls from our coaches and do what we do in practice and just go from there. Um, the are stemming movements that we and the blitzing that we're doing a lot is really uh, helping us uh, to be able to confuse uh, the blocks and uh, blocking schemes and be able to help us penetrate and get to the face of the quarterback and get backfield and get penetration. Uh, he just brings a lot. Um, as far as the big thing was no defense was prepared for him. UCLA wasn't prepared for him. Um, as far as him coming in, he hasn't played um, any games. So they really, all they could have went off was, was high school film. And I'm pretty sure they didn't watch the high school film on him. But um, just everything... I mean, he brought a lot to it, um, but I mean, I also think that UCLA also their their defense was, as far as adjusting to it, was pretty good. So, I mean, it was good play on their side and also by Khalil. I don't know. I think it's you know just just the just the demeanor and the way that we we attack the the game plan as far as for that week. Um, you know, it's been you know it's been pretty successful the last couple of years. So, I mean, the coaches know what they what we need to do and. I mean, uh, you know, we trust in them and, you know, we just do what they tell us to do.